Remember they had an 11 run inning at the beginning of June. Down the right field line and uh, the catch over the railing or no. I, not sure a good effort nonetheless. He got the ball that's really all that matters. That's uh, exactly. Do it barehanded just grab it. Oh, oh yes yeah. he did he did. Is he going to make another it. one? Do it. Did oh, he? He got it he again. Got it again. Oh, you oh, got to be oh, kidding oh, me. That same kid. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> what are the odds? That is unbelievable. And we're doing it again. I don't care. <laughs> you have got to be kidding me. <laughs> oh, off the glove, too. I tell you what, I've been to, what, 300 games in my career? I haven't caught one foul ball. That guy got two in one at bat. If you catch two straight foul balls in a row, you become a legend. And that's the case for my new friend here, Brandon Ortiz. Now, Brandon, you made it look easy. Have you ever caught a foul ball before? Not really, never. All right, so what was going through your head after you caught the first one? And you're like, OK, cool, I caught a foul ball. Yeah, I thought, I thought, oh my god, my first ever foul ball. It was nice. and that after I saw the second one come at me, I'm like, oh my God, I'm gonna catch two. When I caught two, I was just amazed. You just couldn't believe it at all that you had just caught two foul balls. When I see a foul ball come my way, I usually just hide underneath my clipboard. It's actually pretty embarrassing. So can you please give me some tips on how I could catch a foul ball if one comes towards me? Just close your eyes and put your glove up. Close my eyes. That is good advice right there. Done, guys. Excellent stuff. I mean, what, uh, what an at-bat. Never mind a half inning. What an at-bat right there.